Hello everyone. I realized that I never showed you my new Celine bag. This one. I bought it in the beginning of April and I haven't I don't think I ever mentioned that I even got it. I didn't do unboxing and I didn't do review. Okay, so I decided to fix that. And this is a Celine Sengal bucket bag in a bigger size. I got it on fashion file. Um, I got it uh, in excellent condition for $1,905. In a retail right now, this bag is exactly the same bag, uh, but new one version and I explain you what new is $2,400. Only difference is this is old ceiling. You can tell it by the apostrophe over E. And the new new ones are without it. But I think uh, they're exactly the same. I went in the store and looked at the new one. Um, but I decided to get it from Fashion File because first of all, I didn't want to pay full price. Second of all, this was in excellent condition. Third of all, I had a little bit of store credit in um, on Fashion File. Why not you use it? I was waiting for this bag to come on um, website. And by the way, when it showed up, I didn't have a full amount for this bag um, in, in terms of uh, store credit. So, but I knew I'm gonna sell more more items to Fashion File, so I just put it on layaway. Yes, Fashion File has an option um, to put it on layaway. You pay 25% uh, down payment, and um, they will hold it for you for, I think, um, or you can pay it in um, portions, there are obviously terms, they, they're not gonna hold it for you forever. I think second, second payment should be in two weeks. Every two weeks you have to pay something, but all I was waiting just my store credit to come through. And as soon um, I paid in full, they send it to me, excellent condition. And I feel like this uh, leather is indestructible. Clearly, I love bucket bags. Hence my current bag, Louis Vuitton bucket bag. They're very similar, by the way. This is smaller, of course. Um, I love it because it's, uh, my style is usually pretty casual and this is like ultimate casual bag. Um, you can, um, between totes and bucket bags, I gotta say I love bucket bag more. I feel like it's more stylish and I feel like it's younger. How this bag got my attention, I was watching Emma Hill, a British blogger. Um, I love her style uh, and I basically love everything she wears. And when I saw that she got this bag, I decided I need one but I didn't want to pay a full price that's why I um, decided to wait until it comes up on the fashion file and it did okay let me show it um, on me as usual I like to show it on my frame Again, I'm a 5A, and that's how that bag hits me, hits me um, at the hip. This is short strap. You always can buy additional long strap, and I think it's adjustable in um, selling stores. In this case, it will hit you longer, or you can wear it crossbody, but I'm pretty happy with the, this strap for now, because those straps alone are pretty expensive. And um, it has a hook here, which you can close in case you don't want it to be open. It has four pockets here. This is a sign again. 
and inside there is no lining another thing i like very much it just suede as i i believe it's another side of the uh, leather and it has one um pocket here how to show you so you can see can you see this is a pocket i don't think you can see oh okay this is a pocket and that that pocket has another pocket which is zipped kind of secret pocket this bag is not the lightest bag uh, it's pretty thick leather but it's not like very heavy I'm barely heavy by the way I want to show you my outfit as well these are top shop jeans which are old with this denim um, belt they came together and I'm kind of wearing them non-stop. I feel like they're fluttering. Um, yeah, and this is Zara top. Let me put my um, Louis Vuitton back as a comparison. This is obviously, well, this packed right now, but I'm gonna transfer my items from here to here because I'm planning to wear this bag for a little bit and so I can show you how it feels, how it looks when it's filled up. I love, I basically love this look. I love this look. By the way, guys, I realized why I love Louis Vuitton. A little off the topic, but I realized why I love Louis Vuitton so much because this is basically my style, what you see on me. So pretty basic and pretty simple and casual. So I feel like any Louis Vuitton bag in canvas kind of adds a lot to my simple outfits. The canvas needs pretty basic outfit to go with. That's what I think. Okay, but this video is not about Louis Vuitton. Let's put it aside. This is about this bag. Okay. Now I'm going to show you, um, did I show you the leather? Yeah. I'm going to show you what fits in it. And I'm going to, this is, this one is pretty packed. I don't have it that packed usually, but it just happened to be, I needed a lot of stuff when I was out. So just, um, for the sake of, um, experiment, I'm going to put everything what's here and you can see it's not even packed to the green but height wise but it's pretty packed let's see if it fits here all right this is my agenda i usually don't carry it around it's my desk agenda but i just grabbed it because i needed it i needed it to take with me so fits perfectly uh my little pochette or whatever that is um my glass case mask this is my sunglasses i had umbrella in let's put it in but i'm gonna put it maybe outside no actually i don't like it maybe maybe it's in here yeah i can put it in here and uh, car keys, my current wallet. Yeah, a lot of Louis Vuitton, I know. Uh, hand cream, which I'm gonna put here because I literally use it every second. Uh, what else I have here? Well, basically nothing except garbage. It's not the mask, which I'm gonna put here, uh, yeah, a lot of usual stuff. And, but my, um, this bag has, um, by the way, some more organizer in it. Um, because I feel it's less structured than this. This does not need organizer for sure. So, uh, but maybe if I really want to, Maybe I can use this for this. No, maybe not, it's too big, I think. 
Okay, so that's it. I put everything from this bag in here. And that's how it looks to Dove. Yeah, pretty heavy, pretty heavy. I would think, but no more heavy than that one. That's it. These pockets are very, very comfortable for easy access, like you just take out your umbrella or if you have a bottle of water, small bottle of water also fine. I would have put my wallet here for obvious reasons, but other than that, everything I need is here. By the way, let's just put this iPad in there too. Perfect. Obviously it's heavy, got much heavier, but bearable. Especially if you're in a car and very comfortable. Okay, this bag gonna be my bag of the day for a while. Even though I uh, tend uh, not to wear black bags in the summer, I kind of feel like I want to do it. I'm a little bit, little bit overwhelmed with Louis Vuitton. Guys, if you are a season subscriber, you probably know that majority of my bags are Louis Vuitton because this is my number one brand. And, um, but you do sometimes want something different. Okay, this is it for today. I hope you liked my video. Let me know what you think about this bag, how you like it. Let me know what you want me to talk about in, um, future videos if you want me to review a particular bag and I don't have uh, the review yet on a channel or you want me uh, to make videos about um, something else, I'm kind of ready to expand a little bit beyond bags, luxury and this kind of stuff. So let me know. This is it for today. I wish you well, I wish you health, happiness, stay safe, and I'll see you in another video. Bye!